All right, guys, Yard Six, welcome back to the channel. So I'm going to answer the question of tattoos. Can you have tattoos in the Marine Corps? Well, the the question to that, the answer to that is yes. You you could have tattoos. The only problem is going to be is that the Marine Corps highly regulate that. The Marine Corps regulates that based on the fact that. You know, you represent the Marine Corps, so they don't want you to look in a specific place. So a lot of you guys are going to say, well, you know, there are a lot of Marines have tattoos. And, you know, that's true. And, and I'm known for having a few tattoos. But the reality is that back in 2007, or at least the last time I checked, remember, I got out about, I got out of the Marine Corps about two and a half years ago. The policies changed. Now, the policy used to be that you could have, you know, tattoos, a sect. When I was in, a sect in your neck and your hands. Now, if you look at the Army, you look at the Navy, you could tell that some of those guys uh, have different regulation. I know in the, in the Navy, I saw guys with tattoos in their hands. In the Army, I saw guys with, with tattoos in the neck. Marines, when I was in, they weren't able to do that, but they were able to have tattoos coming down all the way into here, as long as they didn't represent something negative. Obviously, if you belong to some type of group and you have something, you know, that, that you're not supposed to have or you have something that could be really offensive and things like that, that was regulated as well. But you were able to do that. Now, back in 2007, that changed. And now it's to the point that you are not, you know, uh, you're not supposed to show any tattoos. So what they typically do is that they get one of the skivvy shirts, one of the green ones that they wear, Marines wear, they put it on, and if you cannot see that tattoo, you, you're you good to go. Typically, that's kind of like the rule that a lot of guys follow. Now, I got to tell you, some of you guys trying to join the Marine Corps, you're going to join, then you're going to get a tattoo, then you're going to go to your first unit, and you're going to say, you know, oh, I had that tattoo before I came in, in the Marine Corps. I got to tell you, it's not going to work out. You will get caught. You will get in trouble. I had a really good Marine that got in trouble uh, while I was in Okinawa. And, you know, it, it happened. I believe he lost rank now. I can't remember. And, and again, he was a really good Marine. And, and unfortunately, he got caught up into that. Now, the point that I'm going to try to, you know, try to kind of stress to you guys is that, again, you're going to join the Marine Corps. You're going to play the rules. Is there rules? You get a tattoo, it may cost you your career. You may not be able to re-enlist. You may not be able to stay longer. You may not be able to do things that you wanted to do based on the fact that you wanted to get a little tattoo right here. So again, like I say, you know, I understand that some of the guys want to get a bunch of tattoos, and I and I get that. I went through a period in my life that I did something similar. But what I got to tell you is that a tattoo right here could potentially cost you your career. So be really, really careful. Inform yourself. Read the Marine Corps order. Know what you're doing before you do it because, again, it could potentially cost you a lot of things. Now, you're going to go to some units that they may not be able or, or they don't really enforce those regulations. And, and you know what? Maybe nothing happens to you. Or you may go into a unit that really enforced that type of regulation and then something could potentially happen to you. Now, I'm going to tell you, once you join, and as you go up in ranks, once you go to staff sergeant, you know, I, I retired at the rank of staff sergeant. Once you go to staff sergeant uh, rank, you will be take pictures of you will be taken and those pictures will be submitted to a board. That board may review your entire, uh, your entire record and may review your tattoos to see if you get promoted. And a lot of guys, you know what, maybe they didn't get caught in the first six, seven years of the Marine Corps career, and now when they go for that staff sergeant rank, they could potentially get caught and could potentially end up their career, you know, because they want to get a little thing over here. So again, guys, if you want to get tattooed, that is up to you. That's your personal decision. But very, be very, very well aware because, like I said, the Marine Corps has a policy, and they will enforce the policy. So again, let me know what you think. If you got more questions, put them down below. Appreciate you guys watching. As always, if you like this videos, click like, subscribe to the channel, share the videos, and God is in control.